now day two in Fort Vlad, and we have a special reception for the officers and chiefs, Soviets, and Americans alike. We have over here, we have St. Pat Fleet. Hi, this is Chief Miller. We're at the Defense Attaché's reception in the Atel Vladivostok. Uh, there, as you can see, as we'll pan across the room in a minute or two, there are literally many people here that are uh, guests of the Defense Attaché of the Consular General of the United States of America. As you can tell, I've only been in Vladivostok two days and my Russian is improving immensely, or Balshoi, as they say here. Um, I'm drinking a Coke, and uh, it's warm, but that's the way things are here at the Defense Attaché reception. Now we'll go talk to some people. Thank sure. Hi, this is uh, Admiral Bennett, uh, C uh, Ops for the Admiral Larson. Uh, sir, what do you think about your visit to Russia so far? I, uh, I'm a little afraid to tell you how much fun I'm having, but it's uh, it's been wonderful. It's uh, I've had uh, lots of uh, too much food to eat, too much vodka to drink, uh, lots of pretty girls to look at, and uh, I hope everyone's having as much fun as I have. Well, thank you, Admiral Bennett. Uh, this will be shown on our nightly news uh, when we get back underway for uh, the Princeton. Uh, you'll probably uh, wait until I leave the ship. And play the show <laughs> no, we won't. <laughs> Thank you, Admiral. Okay. Uh, let's talk to someone else. Hi, this is Chief Miller again with the Captain Hans, the commanding officer of the Princeton, and uh, Captain, I'm sorry, I don't know his name, sir. Tegintiev. Tegintiev. Captain and Mrs. Tegintiev, and he is the commanding officer of the Admiral Vinogradov. And uh, I would like to uh, ask you, Captain, how are you enjoying your trip in Russia? I, uh... We've been here uh, since yesterday morning, and uh, it's been one of the toughest weeks I've had so far <laughs> in my life. Thank you, Captain. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Can I ask you what you have in your purse? <laughs> Avocado. Avocado. And, uh, sir, uh, I understand you're a party animal. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Translate for the uh, folks back home. The question yeah. means the party was not meant to be with women. It meant no, to be no. drinking and drinking. partying. Yes, yes. 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 <laughs> uh, uh, did you get to uh, come to San Diego, sir? Yes, yes, he came to San Diego. And. Uh, I'm very glad we got to come to uh, Vladivostok, and uh, could you would you like to say something to the crew of the Princeton for our news? Он очень рад, что попал в Владивосток и просит хотели бы сказать пару слов экипажу Princeton. Yes, of course. Dear friend, okay, okay. Мы рады приветствовать я командир советского боевого корабля «Адмирал Виноградов», побывавший у вас в Сан-Диего и наблюдавший вас в вашей родной стране и в близкой для вас обстановке. Рад приветствовать от имени экипажа себя лично, от имени моей семьи и моей жены. Галина. Да. У нас в Владивостоке. Так. Uh, he's the commanding officer, or I am a commanding officer of uh, Vinogradov, and uh, I had a chance to come to San Diego and observe uh, the 
United States people in action and at home and now he's very glad to uh, welcome the crew of uh, Princeton to his home and from his wife and from himself, from his family and from the crew of the ship, he welcomes everybody to Vladivostok. I hope that the visit will go for your equipage, your new, good, beautiful ship, the biggest in the Navy of the United States. Thank you very much, very much, that you will remember for yourself очень много новых впечатлений, пообщаетесь с нашими матросами, с нашими людьми здесь, в Владивостоке, с русскими людьми. Такие контакты, не... я лично глубоко убежден в том, что только укрепят наши отношения не только как друзей, но и между государствами, а также между нашими нами. И при совместном плавании где-то в удаленных районах моря или океана, любого океана, Я думаю, что мы теперь всегда найдем охотно найдем общий язык. He's very glad to have uh, our brand new vessel of the United States Navy in Vladivostok, and he hopes that this trip will contribute to the better relationship between our countries and our navies. And he says that one day, if two of our ships will ever come side by side in a uh, war zone or a tough military situation, we will operate jointly and uh, successfully under same orders. Мы, советские военные моряки, наши матросы, офицеры и командиры кораблей, так же, как и наши адмиралы, очень уважаем ваши э, ну, возможности, способности как моряков. Так, мы наблюдали вашу швартовку в Владивосток, наблюдали ваши корабли в Сан-Диего, наблюдали э, всю Navy Station в Сан-Диего, э, наблюдали, да, Мирамар, наблюдали вас в море. Нам всегда импонировало ваше то, что вы хорошие моряки и хорошо решаете свои задачи. Вы действуете всегда уверенно и целеустремленно. They've always had respect for our sailors and the officers and the crew. They observed us do a perfect docking in San Diego. They observed us in Vladivostok. They observed the ships, and uh, they respect and the entire Soviet Navy respects the way the U.S. Navy operates. Моя команда, я в этом глубоко уверен, всегда пойдет на встречу с американским военным морякам в любом вопросе, который может возникнуть в ходе службы нашей совместной на море. И все зависит от, наверное, ну даже не матросов, а от двух капитанов, то есть меня и командира ракетного крейсера «Принстон». Я с капчан. He says that he, he is positive that the crew would say the same thing as he did, that they would always enjoy being side by side with the U.S. Navy in any circumstances at any time. And if the decision was to come down to operate together, that the decision would be made by both captains, him and captain of uh, cruiser Princeton. Well, I, uh, I would like to uh, make a, a quick comment, and that is the fact that the port visit exchanges that we've had have, have been termed as goodwill and they've been termed as people-to-people -people exchanges and the most fantastic uh, thing about the visit in the last uh, 36 hours that we've been here has been the people part of the visit uh, everyone has been warm and friendly and open and uh, uh, we certainly are impressed with the uh, the ships the size of the Frunz, uh, the uh, the size of uh, the Admiral Vinogradov, and the uh, appearance, the warlike appearance of your ship is impressive. But the overall number one thing that uh, we are all impressed by is the the people-to-people -people exchange. So I want to thank you for the the warm welcome and the hospitality here in Vladivostok, and I hope we can all survive the next uh, two days. Он говорит, что э, идея этих обменов на мир. Но даже когда мы здесь, мы осмотрели ваш корабль, мы осмотрели Фрунзе, мы очень э, довольны и потрясены размерами кораблей и боеготовностью, особенно боеготовностью адмирала Виноградова. Но самое главное, это его возбудило отношение людей. И он очень благодарит вас за прием и благодарит всех людей города. 
и кто постарался приложиться к этому приему, и од... э, откровенные, и честные, и хорошие люди. От лица команды и всех жителей Владивостока я хочу поблагодарить, пользуясь случаем, команду крейсера «Принстон» и в его лице весь американский народ. Неважно, где он живет, Лонг-Бич, Сан-Диего, окей. За теплый прием, который был оказан нашим советским морякам, как представителям нашего русского народа у вас в Сан-Диего, в Соединенных Штатах. И в свою очередь пожелать вам приятно провести время. Welcome to Владивосток, welcome to Russia. Okay? От экипажа корабля Виноградов он желает всему... I'm sorry about this, yeah. <laughs> From the entire crew of Vinogradov to the entire crew of, uh, of Princeton, he wishes to spend great next couple of days. And uh, he wants to thank the entire uh, United States and the city of San Diego for giving a very warm welcome to his ship, his people who are representative of the Russian people, and uh, he tremendously enjoyed it. Now, the, the news show, Eye on Princeton, which Chief Miller and his people do every several days is not meant to be a serious uh, piece of uh, news with a bunch of old captains <laughs> talking seriously about relationships between countries. <laughs> But what we're doing is we're making long speeches so that Chief Miller will have a difficult time editing his tape. <laughs> okay. Welcome to Vladivostok. And до скорой встречи. море. Welcome to Vladivostok and uh, see you at sea sometime. I think that's about a wrap for tonight's edition of Ion Princeton. Thank you. You and no? How about you? No? We're gonna try to interview one of the waitresses here at the dad reception, but they don't seem too uh too hep to this proposal. Perhaps we'll just mingle. Wait. Here this looks like the head Davushka of the Oh, she's running away. She sees the camera. Ah, here we go, here we go, here we go. I had a good rehearsal. Who farted? <laughs> I don't know. We're filming. Okay. Is it? Is it true, sir? You know, I've been in three world wars. All my medals show you. Yes. All world wars. This one. That's Stalin. Yes. And Brezhnev. And President Reagan. And. Uh, uh, my mother, yes, general, is it, general is it, mother. Is it true that uh, that all these uh, uh, medals and, and honors is actually a sign of uh, sexual inadequacy? Uh, I don't want to talk about that. Don't talk I think we have another medal coming I have here, sir. Have you more bravery. Have more bravery. We have, bravery. We have an award ceremony right here for bravery. Find, find a spot, spot anywhere anywhere just stick it on uh, and this is for uh, this is for paperwork beyond the hours of endurance eating beyond and above more two plates two plates and go back again ah, thank you Good luck thank you sir yes. thank you I must go to Iraq now and get all those rag heads now bye bye that was Lieutenant Keitzer of HSL 47, for those of you that don't know it. Uh, if, as if the shoulder boards weren't heavy enough, he had to have something else on his shirt to weigh him down. Who knows what's going on in the mind of Airedales. There's a serious rumor that the chaplain has left his wife of 14 years and is picking up a nice young Sasha. Let's find out if it's true. Chaplain, is it true? Yes. It's true, you heard it here first on Ion Princeton. <laughs> and perhaps, and you'd like to introduce her, sir? Yes, definitely. Yes, and this is? Speedy. 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 Sveta. Sveta. Savod Grisha. Очень приятно. Очень приятно. Очень рад. We're talking in Russian here, isn't this wonderful? You're on television. We're going to watch it on our ship. I'm happy. Uh, are you a translator? Sure. Sure. Hey, so am I. <laughs> we are colleagues. 
We are twins of the different You're mothers. <laughs> <laughs> no twins. No twins. No twins. Oh. Are you enjoying yourself, Chaplin? Yes, having a great time. Are you enjoying yourself? Sure. Is that short for Setlana? What? Your name. Setlana. Setlana. Uh, having a great time. Wonderful people. Uh, very warm, very friendly. How could you not have a good time? Okay, I have a question to ask you, sir. Have you been asked a lot about religion, seeing as you wear the cross? Tremendous. Every day, uh, many, many people come aboard the ship and ask about it. Very curious about it. I'm very interested in, in, in religion in our country. Okay. Well, what more can we say? It's the chaplain on Ion Princeton, usually behind the camera. This time we got him with his pants down. Thank you. Here we are. Here we are in the Hotel Vlad, and I have two very beautiful Russian women with me. Marina, Natasha. Natasha, is it true you're starting to become a nun? What do you say for me? I don't understand you very well. Actually, your name is Natalie. Natalie. My name is Natalie. Natalie. And I make acquaintance with Steve. In the evening. evening. In the evening. In the last Steve. evening. In the last right. evening. Right. Yeah. Right. yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a song in there somewhere. I hear music. <laughs> Is it happening? It's happening. We're friends. Good friends. Good friends. Good friends. Yeah, good, good friends with Steve. Good friends. Good tovarich. And Marina knew Jim. Met Jim last night. Jim. Jim. Jim who? You know it's She's Jim. She's waiting for Jim, but Jim. Jim. Oh, Jim. Jim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who that is. That's all we need to say. That's all we need to know. Okay. Marina. Marina. Uh, Jim. Ask her about Jim. Do you know, do you know Jim? No. No. My name is Marina. Marina. My name is Greg. My name is Marina. 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 She is waiting for Jim. She don't Marina speak English. Jim. She don't speak English. What? What do you do? What is your job? Students. She is studying in the technological institute. In the Technological Institute. In the Technological yeah. Institute. You will be an engineer. And time too. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Romano. And thank and it's really great to find that there still are women in the convent in Russia. Yes. Yes. Well, oh, some Russian. Now Steve. Speak you some Russian words. Say you some Russian words. Okay, go. Kaktila. Chopchimu. Lalu Lalu Vlu. Okay. Can I ask can I ask you a question? Who does your makeup? What do you say? Who does your makeup? Makeup. Thank you. Yergu? It's very cara show. Oh, she got us. I understand you. Ah, thank you. Bye. Senior Chief Waiters, a man that's never at a loss for words. Let's see if he's camera shy. Oh, never camera shy. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, whoever we're talking to. Senior Chief of Command, USS Reuben James. This is my good friend right here, Chief Miller. And we're coming to you live. Yes, we are live, Richie. <laughs> we're coming to you live from the USS Raw Vladivostok. Vladivostok. As you can see, we're having a great time. This guy is definitely destined for bigger and better things. Thank you, and have a good evening. Thank you, senior. Let's uh, see if we can get some more goats to talk. Hey, what about you? What about me? I heard you forgot your underwear. Not me, no. Oh, it must have been somebody that looked like you. <laughs> okay, here's the, here's the waitresses again. Let's see if they'll talk. Would you talk to me? Извините. Пожалуйста. А по говорите по-английски? Нет. А мы можем позвать товарища, он знает. Are you the head waitress? Только по-русски говорит. Well, what does your uh Maitre d'hotel. Как вас зовут? Вера. Вера. Меня зовут Гриша. Гриша? Гриша. 
Okay, um, you're uh, you're in charge of this. Uh, thank you. Hi, we're here with uh, the head waiter, Chef Henri Monez, the French waiter. Uh, you are the speak French? A little bit. A little bit, and you wear the funny hat to funny cook hat. with? I hate it though, but I have to. You hate it, but you have to. And what is your specialty? Chicken adobo. Chicken adobo. And uh, you also do no. the chicken, uh, the nuggets? The nuggets, teriyaki, and all kinds of stuff. Gilly gilly stuff. Gilly gilly. <laughs> uh, are you enjoying yourself in Vladivostok? It's great. I like it. Love it. Uh, that's wonderful. Um, so what is your duty tonight? Do tonight? I ain't got no duty tonight. Lucky. Lucky you. Your duty? He ain't got no duty tonight. Oh, so you're just here out of the goodness of your heart. I'm here for the party and then we're gone. What? I'm just here for the party and then we're gone. After the party, you hit the skids. Hit the skids, beach. You got, you got your regular uniform here? Yes, I do. So you're ready to like just change and go? Yes, I am. Ready to go. What are you going to do with these fine duds? Trade them in for a car? Trade them in for a car or whatever. <laughs> uniform. <laughs> All right. Um, so, uh, what's the hardest thing about doing one of these parties? Mm, nothing. Not piece of cake. Just working hard, long hours. That's about it. Oh, it's nothing. It's just 12 hours working hard. Um, where did we get the shrimp from? There's a lot of shrimp here. So we got them from Japan. 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 It's very good. Everything is very good. Very I wish you people back on the Prince could taste some of this food. It's very good. Well, thank you again. Thank you. I'm uh, I'm interviewing people for Ion Princeton. It's our little news show we do on the ship. Yeah, you can eat on television. It's okay. They do a lot of things on TV not now. Not the best. Not the best, but it'll it, do. It's not the best, but it's the water. Hey. Exactly. It'll do. Anyways, uh, we're here with uh, Victoria Jarokova. And you have a calico cat? No, you don't have a calico cat. Uh, she, she has a cat. She has. You yes, have a cat. I don't have. And you don't have any, any cats and any dogs. Yeah. You don't have any pussy? No. Oh, that, I'm sure a lot of guys will be really bummed out to hear that. Um, Chief. Where? <laughs> where are you from originally? Uh, from? Uh, what what city? Vladivostok? I, I lived here for a long time, but I was born in Moscow. 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 Uh, are you a Muscovite? No, I can't say so because I spent many years here, and I can say that it's my native city. Uh, my daddy took me here Just like her when mommy. I was a little, because he's an officer. Oh, your father was in the military? Yeah. The Navy? Not Navy, from Marine Corps. Oh, Marine Corps. Uh, Soviet Naval Infantry. Uh, we don't call it infantry. Oh, okay, just Marines. Marines, yeah. What do you call? What's the what's the uh, Russian word for a sailor? I like them. You and, like them? Yeah. And I'm glad to see them here. And no. I'd like to see them again here, maybe some years later. Some years, not some weeks. Oh. I think that it's impossible to to see you next year. I know that you will be here in two years. Yeah, every two year. Is it is it so? Yeah, uh, I probably. He would know. Why do you think so? He's I, our I, scheduling officer. Uh, I couldn't tell him because I'd have to kill him. So. Yeah. It's one of those. If he told me, he'd have to kill me. Believe it. I'll that was a joke. I'll tell you. I'll tell he you said, later. He said to me many times. So you, you've been telling skids many no, times. No. Yeah, I got to use it. We got this. No, 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 no. <laughs> so, so, so you've had pillow talk. Uh, what will, will you repeat? When you talk to your pillow. What is it? Dreams and uh, nights. Dreams. Dreams. Uh, dreams during sleeping. During during sleeping, yes. And, during sleeping talk. And I don't talk during my dreams. She doesn't. No. <laughs> we have an eyewitness account here. <laughs> but why do you ask me such questions? I am curious about you and your country. Uh, and you think that many people of our country talk 
during their dreams? Uh, some. Some. You have already asked them about it? Yes. Oh, maybe, but I don't. Okay, fine. How about snoring? Snoring? No. No, no snoring. We had no snoring. So, well, thank you for sharing your nocturnal habits with us. Uh, I'm sure the crew, of the, would you like to say anything to the crew of the Princeton? The entire crew. The entire, the whole ship. Anything. 350 men. 350 plus men. Plus filled men. I can sense that I enjoy you. You heard it here. This is entertainment at its best. Thank you, Victoria. You're welcome. This is too much, too good, too soon. It's the ultimate. Now we're just going to go around and, and, and greet everybody and just kind of say, hi, how you doing? And uh, we'll probably see a lot of people run away from the camera. Thank you. OK, we're here with a Russian gentleman. Sir, I'd like to thank you very much for making my stay in Vladivostok uh, the most memorable liberty port I have ever been to in my life. Говорит, что я хочу поблагодарить вас за то, что за хорошее пребывание здесь в Владивостоке, которое впервые случилось в его жизни. And do you, do you have anything you'd like to say to the crew of the USS Princeton? Мы хотели бы что-нибудь сказать для Princeton, для корабля Princeton Соединенных Штатов Америки. Ну, я бы мог сказать следующее, хотел бы сказать, что мы рады встрече с американскими. I'd like to tell you that we are very glad to meet yes, American sailors were here in Vladivostok. 50 лет назад такая встреча была. Но я не был участником этой встречи. Yes, 50 years ago there was such a meeting, but I was not a participant of that meeting. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Спасибо большое. Okay, let's see if we can get someone else to interview. Yes, my very own division officer is learning the Russian language through a very capable and beautiful translator. Let's find out how he's doing, shall we? Krusey. Welcome to Ion Princeton. You've never been a guest before. Uh, how's your Russian language going? I've always wanted to be in Russia. It is very exciting for me. Your Russian is very good, sir. Do you know any more? Yes, I do. Manyat Zavod Jean Clemson. You heard it here first. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Cruzy has has learned that his name